What are we doing, boys? Why can't you just do it right here? Just driving up north. Drake, what do you got? On, on Snapchat. Yep. What are we doing? Head north. Going to hunt some some Michigan monarchs. How long are we going to be up there? A whole week. A whole week. Sunday to Sunday, baby. Well guys, we just arrived at camp. Uh, me, Drake, and Sammy arrived probably 25, 30 minutes ago. Unpacked real quick, got suited up. As you guys can probably tell by the attire we're wearing, it's real hot out. It's probably pushing 80 degrees, but uh, Sammy and Drake are going to one end of the property. Nick and Sammy's dad is in the, kind of the middle, and uh, me and Nick are uh, kind of going to the other end. Nick has been here for two days, he's checked all the cameras that we put out a month ago or three weeks ago. Saw a lot of good sign. So me and Nick are going into a ladder stand kind of in the middle of a swamp. I don't know how much of close quarter action we're gonna have tonight, but we'll definitely be able to see a lot. But uh, yeah, kind of more of an observation shit, but the, there was a camera not too, too far that had a lot of good bucks on it and actually a pretty good nine point hitting a scrape very often, so. Oh yeah, look at this. So, as you guys can tell, scrapes are opened up up here in Michigan, so... I don't know, we got high hopes. It's a little warm, but we'll see what happens. We'll see you guys in the tree. <laughs> Well guys, welcome back to season three. Uh, we're on the evening hunt right now. It's actually probably about 5.30, 5.45. Nick's uh, scouted around for the past two nights and have seen a lot of deer activity. But nonetheless, Drake and Sammy are on the other side of the property, kind of hunting closer to some ag. And me and Nick came in here to more or less a bedding area. We were just like surrounded by the swamp and cattails. We don't know how close quarters it's gonna be tonight just because I don't know how much is gonna come through this certain area, but we actually did jump up probably 100, 105 inch eight point, 45 yards from the tree stand. We got within 20 yards of him. He was right in between us and the tree stand. 40, his bed was like 45 yards from the base of this tree, so. It's hot, it's 80 degrees. We're up here for a week. We'll be coming back home Sunday, so. I definitely think that a, a tag or two will be filled by that. Let's hope something happens tonight. Talk to you guys in a little bit. What do you think about that walk in here? Awful, horrible, worst walk in ever. It's hot as hell right now. It's probably about 80 degrees. We bumped about seven deer. We couldn't see any antlers, but um, they all just blew into this swamp behind us. So um, it's like dead still out here. Barely any wind. We're hoping we can stay quiet and something will roll through.
underneath us and Drake was ready to draw back. <laughs> he almost gave him the shaft. Didn't connect today. Hopefully later. Stay tuned. Where are we going, Nick? Uh, we're gonna head out to Gavin's, we'll call it Gavin's stand, because uh, he kind of picked the location, but it's kind of in front of one of the blinds my dad's been sitting in, he's been seeding deer, and it's kind of closer to the back property line in swamp. So we're thinking a lot of these deer are uh, laying back in the swamp, trying to stay out of this heat. So uh, hopefully we can cut those deer off, heading from the swamp over the neighbor's beans. We're gonna tickle some antlers tonight too. to our left here and uh, it's kind of behind us pretty far out but uh, we got a egg field that they might be going to but we're right down in here there's I know there's some good oak trees around here there's actually a pretty pretty uh, decent size oak tree right over my back here so I can see deer funneling through here uh, getting them acorns so we're gonna we're gonna set it out and let's hope we see some deer Sir, can you give them an interview of your hunt this morning?
sir. Can you give them an interview? Hey, sir. Hmm. Can you give them an interview of your hut this morning? Mm -hmm. What'd you see? Nothing. <laughs> Well guys, I'm here, not for long, but I was able to swing in for just today and stay with the, the boys tonight. Um, I've got some work to do up in Northern Michigan, so I was gonna be in the area anyways and came up a day early. Um, hopefully we're gonna be blood tracking at night. Um, I know you've seen previously in this episode, the boys haven't had much luck, it's been hot. Um, there's not much you can do about that. Um, unfortunately I rolled in when they were out in the woods. So I'm gonna start the fire now. And um, hopefully they're back soon. And hopefully they got good news. There's hardly any cell service here, so I really don't know uh, what's going on out there. But anyways, thanks for watching. <laughs> Noodles are almost done. I got soaked on the walk in, but uh, <clears throat> got everything all set up. I'm just getting settled in, so. Rain's supposed to stop in a couple minutes. Hopefully these bucks get on their feet. It's been raining on us all day. The rain actually just shut off. It's about 5.30. I've been set up in the stand for, since about 5 o'clock. But uh, there's a lot of good deer that cut off of this hardwoods into this swamp transitioning over the egg across the road so the stand's kind of been proven before in the past so with any luck hopefully something will cruise down this wood edge here and uh we can get them nice and tight on us with this rain shutting off it should put them on their feet actually see a deer right now Everything up. It is 
7.30. I was packing everything up, getting ready to get out of here. I went all night. I seen two does, and I looked down, and I got this buck coming right under my stand. I already put my mic away for my main camera, but he comes in, and he's 10 yards right under me. I don't know if I was on him with my main camera when I shot. I'm self-filming right now. It's Thursday, we're leaving Sunday morning. No one's punched a buck tag yet. He came cruising in and I just drilled him and he did a big loop on me and he's laying dead right here, 15 yards. Let's go baby, buck down. Michigan buck tag filled. Let's go, no tag suit. Let's call the boys. Please leave your message for Man, he just came working in on me, and once I ripped my bow back, I was full draw. I wasn't gonna let down. I've uh, hunted in Michigan. This is my third, third or fourth year coming up here, and I'm the only one that hasn't filled the buck their buck tag yet. And uh, when he worked in like that on me, man, I just couldn't pass it up. So. Wow. What's up, dude? Doug <laughs> No, he's not very big. He's not, I think he's at six point maybe you guys seen. He worked in, like, he worked in right, I was packing up actually, and he's like right under me, behind me. Now I'm looking at him, I'm like, thinking about not shooting, and he just stuck around. I threw the camera around, got it kind of on him. GoPro was running. I'm freaking freezing. <laughs> And uh, he was 10 yards right under me, and I just ripped one right through him. And he he did a loop, and he came back towards me, and he landed 15 yards from me. So. We can smoke them, baby. 15 yards. There you go. Have you talked to them? No, I haven't. I just walked up the road and seen you. No, I haven't seen them. Uh, I came out to the road thinking I would maybe see Sammy, but I didn't. Yeah, man, I mean. I was just packing up and he worked in. I was like, it was weird. I was telling myself, I'm like, if something works in right now, like I'm still gonna shoot it even with my camera's away. Yeah. Camera was out, I rolled on both of them, so. Huh. I don't know. Well, that's sweet. Did big. you uh, go take a sneak peek when you got down? I know. And did you? I did not. You lied. No, I'm not. All right, legit. I don't see you. <laughs> We might just be able to stumble upon him though, guys. Well, let's do that. Oh, he's right here. Booyah, Jack. Right here. Alright. Pull that thing up. <laughs> Alright, dude. Dude, that might be the one you drew on it. Crew. Maybe. Your grandpa. What's he got on him? Seven point. He's got a little nipple there. Bad little rack on him. Sweet. Hit him, boys.
I'm not even sleeping. Yeah, you are. Caught on for in 4K. You'll see it on YouTube. Drake always sleeps in.